you know, I grew up playing in the church, believe it or not. And when people say that, they're like, cool, you grew up playing in the church. Cool. Yeah, it was the Lutheran church. Okay, and I brought this up before, like, okay. Immediately, it's like, <laughs> sad. The, the, all the flowers die in the room. <laughs> Joe, <laughs> you bust out the classic trombone, right? <laughs> Wah, 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 which is, of course, all I would do all day long if I played trumpet, I mean trombone, is I would sit there and just go in the band, wah, 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 wah. <laughs> to, you know what I mean, in junior high band or whatever, man, the trombone players were so cool. Those dudes that played trombone, everybody that played trombone, anyone who played trombone, coolest people in the band by far. Um... Anyway, bah, 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 I played in the Lutheran church. And I thought, you know what? Why not just, you know, it's, it's always so hip if you, like, played in the Baptist church or played in the, like, Pentecostal. You got, like, you know, you got, like, Southern traditions, uh, Appalachian traditions, all these other things that are, like, yeah, the church. And then you have these sort of, um, you know, a lot of heavy music coming out of the church. But you're always passing over things like, you know, everybody overlooks like Presbyterians and um, Methodists and uh, Lutherans, and um, uh, you even go for go so far as like the Amish and Mennonite scene, and those different fields. They're all have very very idiosyncratic fields when it comes to worship music. Uh, the Calvinists, you know, think about it. It's like what, what what were the Calvinists doing when they were showing up and singing some jams together? What were the Calvinists basically? If anybody even sang, maybe they were drawn and quartered but if you i'm just talking about like the midwest you got some midwest style religions okay what's another one is, am i covering most of them there episcopalian is that in there no. maybe i don't know catholic. well catholic for sure in fact if you can if you want to do a catholic thing you could just basically if it's grooving you know In Catholic, of course, would be like, it feels too good. Stop. Stop now. It feels too good. That would be the Catholic version, okay? Please repress that. It feels too good. Lutheran, there's a big, there's real, actually, there's real subtle differences between a Lutheran feel, Presbyterian feel, and a Methodist feel, for instance. Okay? Lutheran feel, I know it pretty well. I was in there dealing, okay? <laughs> Trust me. I was dealing. And, um, you know, if you're thinking about the classic two beat. Lutheran would be more like a, this would be, this would be some, some type of feel we would be, be, be working with. Our God is an awesome God. 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 All right, you're dealing with the Presbyterians. Oh, come, all ye faithful. No, that's a little too swinging. Oh, come, oh, come, all ye faithful, joyful and triumphant. Methodist. Methodists like to speed up. They like a like a Methodist like a, like a crescendo. You know what I mean? Is it, what happens when you speed up? Is it Crescendo is a volume going up and down. In fact, we should talk about that at some point, like playing soft into playing loud into playing softer again, right, Joe? Remember we talk about how beautiful the nature sounds are, how you should play the sounds of the ocean, play the sounds of waterfall. But that's the dynamic, the, the water that trickles off of a small waterfall, a big waterfall. It's never too loud or never too soft. It's perfect. Think about nature. That's the only lesson when it comes to dynamics. But if you're dealing in the Presbyterian situation, or Methodists. Is it Methodists? They like to push it, man. You know what I mean? Methodists like to start here. They do that forward thing. They got that forward motion thing. You know what I mean? Now, it's important when you're dealing with the Mennonites and the Amish is it's important, number one, you're not playing electronic drums. I'm going to tell you that right now. We got to keep it analog. We got to keep it whatever. Mennonites is just a straight up, like, hey, listen, we're into this shit, um, but it's cool. You know what I mean? Amish are more like, please get away from us and buy our chickens. Get together and put up a fight. 
show where Amish people moved to New York and they were dealing that is the most fucked up shit I have ever seen like that would age well that was only like five years ago it's like man he, he's going to the hustler club and he's drinking Listerine and he's Amish <laughs>